Space City Pop. Oh, silly Starbucks. Kicks out six cops who are chilling like villains, protecting from the stealings. Some customer who's sitting in Starbucks is like, I have a problem with those big men with guns over there. They're making me anxious. Starbucks manager says, I'll take care of this. Hold on, ma'am. Hold on, okay? Officers are not welcome at Starbucks. They don't deserve our coffee. And kicks them out of the fucking cafe. Drinking coffee, chilling. You know what happens if that Starbucks gets robbed or they have a real problem? Like somebody comes in, there's like a domestic disturbance in the restaurant or some asshole starts pushing another customer. Like they have a real fucking crime or something happen. You know who they call? They're going to call some of those very same cops. That's fucked up. And now Starbucks has apologized. We're sorry, guys. You know, we're sorry. You guys, come on back. We got some coffee for you. Sorry about that whole kicking you out of the fucking cafe thing. <laughs> you guys drink all the coffee you want, okay? Fuck her, all right? No, we fucked up. We know that now. And when we say we fucked up, we didn't know that this was going to make us look bad. We thought it was okay to discriminate. No, no, no. But what they actually said in their apology was, I want to sincerely apologize to you all for the experience that six of your officers had in our stores on July 4th. It was July 4th of all days, right? Like military and cops, like the ones who protect us all, you know? And they're like, fuck you, get out of here, you're not welcome. So as you can imagine, the big PR firm who worked for Starbucks is working overtime right now.